Howdy, folks, how are y'all doing? My name is Reese. welcome back to another episode of our Civ Tech Ages and Let's Play Adventure Extravaganza of Awesomeness and Fun Times, where since last time I've been investigating and I think I figured out how to find ores. Turns out way early on in episode one when I said some of those rocks out there weren't just rocks, I was absolutely correct. Uh, apparently, if we find a rock that isn't a rock, Boy, this is a strange sentence, isn't it? But if we find a rock that's actually an ore, if we go beneath that rock, we'll find some ore eventually. Is this a rock? That's just a rock. That's a disappointment. Hold on. We're going to find an example any second now. We just got to be patient with this. That's still just a rock. We're looking for a rock that doesn't break when we just tap it with a feather. We didn't have a feather before, but now we do. So we're going to tickle the rocks until we find one that doesn't just shatter in our hands. Gotcha, baby. Gotcha. So we're going to collect this one with our pickaxe. Didn't give us anything at all. But theoretically now, we should be able to not dig straight down because we're not silly fools. And uh, maybe we'll find something. Ah! 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 Whoa! Well, I haven't found any ore at all. I feel like the internet, <laughs> surprisingly, has lied to me. Wait a minute. What have we here? Oh, it's just andesite. Hey! Wait, I just noticed that... Oh my gosh! Willia is activated! That must have happened last episode and I didn't even realize it. Well, hold on a second. Andesite? That's just like a basic Minecraft rock, right? It doesn't... Does it do anything particular? We can make polished andesite with it. Uh, hmm. Eh, well, maybe we'll take some with us. It looks kind of nice. Alright then, gonna seal that off. So, one thing I didn't show y'all at the start of the episode... Uh, if you look underwater here, I built a few more of these handy-dandy straining matrons. And uh, they're all equipped to start collecting various objects with our survivalist strainers. And look at that, we got some spruce wood planks. Not quite what we're after. Got some regular wood planks. Still not quite on the money, not exactly what we want. What we're looking for is the dark oak. Birch is the opposite of dark oak. It's the brightest color you can get in terms of wooden Minecraft, but here, this is going to be acacia. Okay, so we have an acacia forest out in front of our house. What good does that do? A strainer? Shrek it! We're going on an adventure. All the other plans have fallen through today. We haven't got any dark oak wood. We've yet to have any ores manifest themselves in our world. We're going on an adventure, then. We're going to go find some dark oak wood. Do I have any... I've got plenty of food. Let's... Let's do this. Give me a raw salmon. And we've immediately returned home because I forgot to get our map book. And I think we're going to need that if we go on any sort of a journey. Okay, and on the road again. Well, on the river once more, I guess. That doesn't make as much sense. It doesn't sound as good. I don't think it would make a good song. On the river again. I can't wait to float down the river again. Seeing pink trees I may never see. Have these been next to my... Hold on just a flippin' second. Hold on a second! What did we need to... This has been right here by my house this whole time, hasn't it? What did we need to core wood for? Just a, a darn minute. Uses. We, we needed this for something in particular, didn't we? I remember exactly what we needed this for. We needed this to... Be, is it... Is it the... It's a core wood! It's a core... You... you it, it's right here by my house! How many comments have I received? right now about this being right next to my home that I've just not noticed because I record these kind of in bulk. I'm as outraged as all the rest of you, trust me. Oh look, we even got some saplings out of the deal. Feeling pretty good about this decision. Now we can finally make that next level- well, I mean, <laughs> now that I think about it, <laughs> crafting stump, it's gonna be pretty useless when we build a crafting table, which doesn't require- what? Wait a minute, doesn't need dark oak? What? It, it looks like it was frozen on dark oak last time. But it's just going through the various types of dark oak. Like... Hold on, hold on just this. Hold on just, uh, let's go home. Let's just go home. Okay. Let's just see what happens here, let's just... ARE YOU SHREKING ME?! This whole time. This whole time, and I just... I didn't even know. <laughs> I'm so happy though. I can't even be mad at myself. Get out of here! Oh my goodness! We can build a regular chest now! <gasps> oh! 
Oh, wait, can I make... No, okay, so that still doesn't work. So regular crafting recipes is still a no-no, but hold on, let me get some more planks. Okay... Hallelujah! 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 Oh, we can finally do storage properly. We don't have to deal with these little babby chests anymore. Actually, these chests, useless though they may be, I might hook up to these machines, or to these, these kilns. Except, can't we now just build a furnace? Uh, hmm. Considering we don't have to use fuel for a kiln, it might be worth keeping these around for things that we don't want to cook up too quickly and and might want to automate pretty easily. But these these will still be handy for certain things. But like all of this back here until all of this gets... Like what I'm trying to say is... We have, we have chests now. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. I'm so excited. What is this one? Light up life with the new furnace. Is it just a good old furnace recipe? Kind of looks like it is. I'm waiting on someone to just show me some cobbles. It's cobblestone, baby. It's not just a boulder. It's a rock. Ah, <laughs> oh, look at this. Oh, baby. Look at this. We can make a leaf bed. Crunchy pillows. Hold on. Bed. What are my new... <gasps> I've got new options. I've got marble pillars and ice... But no, no, those aren't beds. This is bed, though. This is what? Hay... And a willow leaves? A eucalyptus? Any kind of leaf, looks like. Any kind of leaf we can use. A wheat we've got. We can make some hay bales. We got plenty of wheat. I, I mean, I don't know if we have enough wheat for that many hay bales. But, um, let's see. Let's do some harvesting here. Just stay on top of our harvesting. It shouldn't be an issue. Oops, I accidentally broke one. But hold on a second. Guys. Guys, hold on. We can make a hoe. Can we hoe it? Yes, we can! You know, this episode started off so dour, so next level failure, but it's really turned around. I'm I'm thinking this might be my favorite episode in the series. We're almost out of uses on our sleeping mat, which I'm still going to keep around because it's handy for when you travel and you need to sleep. But it'd be nice to have just a real bed here so we don't burn through these sleeping mats so quickly. There's my bone shears. I knew I had some. Alright, uh, you know what? That's probably more than enough leaves. I doubt we're going to need more than, what, 20 we've got now? 21? 22? We're now over the legal drinking age in most, if not all, states. Is that is that a federally mandated thing? I don't know if that's state mandated or federally mandated. But 21 is the drinking age in the U.S. as far as I know. I can't wait to get rid of these stupid shelves and their complicated storing system. How do I make wheat? Balls. Is it... Wheat balls is probably not what we're making, but there we go. A hay bale, even. Okay, we can make one. That's all the, that's all that we've got. <laughs> well, okay. <laughs> Look, we've got seeds and we've got a hoe, so we can expand our growing operation, and that'll certainly get us a bit more wheat a bit more quickly. Okay, so that's a much larger growing area. There's a way to speed it up, though. That's why I went over there and got the totempedia. Go ahead and check ceremonies here. Which one of these was it? Nearby plants will grow at a much faster rate than usual. In addition, any nearby eggs will... Okay, what does this one require? This one requires that we have a flute and wind chimes, both of which are things that I've got. We just have to move them over. And also, we're probably going to have to build a new totem, because I don't think you... I haven't previously been able to pick up totems. Yeah, looks like the totem's pretty much just there, and there's not much you can do about it. Wind chimes we can move, though. Oh! Uh, you should not be over here, horsey. But also, I don't guess that's hurting anything. What happened to your lead, though? Don't get that stupid smile off your face. You broke in my cart. I'm not happy about it. Okay, so we've got that there. We're just gonna whack it with that. We've got our totem base now. We need to hang the chimes off of something? This ought to work, I guess, and we can trim off this extra bit. I don't know why I never thought to just trim off the extra bit over there as well, because it does look a bit silly. Excellent. I also got the flute, but we might need some more instruments. Let's go grab our drum as well. That's a pretty easy one to just hammer on. All right, so let's check one more time. Which order do we need to do to activate these? It's chimes and then the flute. So let's get a free hand, and then we'll do chimes and then the flute. Okay. Well, we're going to run out of time before... Okay, we're going to need more instruments for this to work. Okay, rattle and drum combo is totally the way to go. Boom! Look at that! Holy snap! They do grow much faster! You can literally just stand here and right-click to harvest the stuff as quick as it grows. Um, This is the best. This is the best thing ever. How much do we have now? 
22. Oh my gosh, it just keeps going. Okay, and it looks like the magic party has ended. For the best. Um, I think we've got pretty much everything we needed. We'll leave all our stuff here for now. We'll move it back over once we need to kill some more uh, sheep or, or cows or buffalo. All right, so it was hay bales, but then what else went into the bed? Which I completely forgot about because I got real distracted by. Oh, pink and black stuff, of course. Looks like leaves. That's correct. I remember now. That was odd that it couldn't quite figure out what ironwood leaves were. That That's concerning. We've got a bed of straw and leaves, though. Wait, what? It will... Be destroyed if broken once placed. Uh-oh. We need to pick a very good spot for it, then. Ah, uh, bedroom. Bed bedroom. Decision has been made. There you go. We'll sleep next to all of our machines. We've put a flammable bed next to a torch. Probably not going to be a problem. Prospecting. Craft a weak dousing rod to locate ore. Oh, it just gets better and better. Oh, that's an easy recipe, too. Like, we've, we've literally got everything we need for it. We're even going to use some of this handy-dandy Sakura wood. Oh, look how good it looks. It does look really good, doesn't it? Dowsing rod. This tool may only be used for ore in age 1 and below. Will detect unlocked ores in a 48-block straight line. Oh, and we've also picked up some sort of manual. Uh, should we read through this? Introduction, getting started, samples, prospecting... Oh my gosh, there's a lot to read through. It's a mod. It's had difficulty to mining. Most of the menu will assume that the configs are default, but may make a mention of possible config options when relevant. Hmm. Okay, I've given the book a quick reading, and I think we're ready now to go do some cave exploration, or spelunking, as the kids call it. Ha 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 ha. And uh, maybe we'll find something? Nothing of interest. Oh dear. Oh! Oh! Woo! -hoo! Oh, this is different! This, I, what, okay. Apparently all we had to do was wander over here from over there. Where did we do some, do, were we, where were we mining before? Doesn't matter, I found some Talatite. Some Teslatite, some, some whatever that is. Okay, it's down here. It's gotta be down here, right? Nothing of interest. Okay, well, there was a sample up here. There's gotta be something- Okay, block. There are, like, samples on the ground here. There's got to be something of interest down there. Come on, now! Oh, it's getting dark. Let's head in. We'll go to bed. We'll come back. We'll try this again in the morning. Okay, I don't know if this is where I was a second ago. Oh, hold on. Yeah, there's a hole that I dug. Okay, sweet. We found our way back. Now, we just poke around here. I think. Ah, we found... Okay! Alright, nobody panic. Nobody panic. We're gonna do this. We're gonna figure this one out. Oh. Oh! Nobody panic. It's fine. Let's very quickly secure our surroundings. Uh, we'll build a barricade here. Never dig straight down, kids. That said, we have to keep digging straight down. Oh, to another... another cave. The well, easiest thing we can do here is just make ourselves a water plume. There we go. That gives us a way out, at least. Oh! Oh! Not fast enough! Not fast enough! Okay. Okay. Nope. You're very aggressive, spider. You're very aggressive. You gotta go. I'm sorry. You're not attacking me now, but you were attacking me a second ago. Can't allow that to happen again. Alright. I should keep us safe from whatever's down there. Uh, further still? Further still. Okay. Ah! Ha-ha! Hey! Ah, oh, we've got to the copper! It's a copper cluster! What do we do with that? What do we- what is a copper cluster? That'll give us one ingot? Apparently we have to do it via smelting, can't just put that in a furnace. Fair enough. I actually needed some iron equivalent though, not copper, but this is fine. Or did I? What did I even need iron for? I don't know. Apparently we can pick up these entire clusters if we have silk touch, but I'm not sure what the advantage there is. There is a lot of this stuff down here. Just throwing that out there, like, a whole lot of it. Um... My gosh, I don't think we're ever gonna run out. If one actually generates an ingot, then my gosh. Ooh, if we had a crusher. We could get two copper grit. Okay, we have a stack and a half of this stuff. That's more than we're going to need for a while. We need to get out of here now. I'd say let's make it easy for us to get back, but do I really want to build a staircase all the way up? No. We should have brought some ladders with us. 
Oh, well. Speaking of which, can we build ladders now? Oh, my gosh. We can build ladders now. Can we build fences? <gasps> oh, my gosh! We can build fences! Can we build... Oh! Oh. Okay. So we found a way down now. Let's go ahead and mark it with some of this stuff. That's, uh... That's our new mine shaft. Where, where is home? Oh, hi there. How are you doing? I'm just gonna head back to the house and crawl up into my hay and leaves and take a nap. Okay. Excellent. Well, folks, I'll tell you what. I've been recording for an hour now, and I'm not sure what we actually accomplished today, but we've got a bed. What am I kidding? We've got a regular chest. We've got a crafting table. Oh my gosh, we found some ores. Let's see if we can cook them up in here, though. Because we're still not sure what we're supposed to be able to do here. Hey! That's progress! That's doing a thing! How do we get it out of there? Do we have to build the traditional, like a... What, like a tap? I don't think it's called a tap. Let's see, let's check at Tinker's Construct. Maybe a casting basin, and then a faucet? And then do we have to put the faucet up against, like, a little drain thing? Or does the faucet just plug in anywhere we want it to? Because I don't even see a drain, like a proper drain. I don't know. I honestly don't know. I guess we'll find out uh, somehow or another, I suppose. We'll figure out how to get things out of there. For right now, though, here's my plan. We can build doors. We can build fences. We can... Can we build just stone now? Like, if I took four stone and put them in a circle, could I make a... Uh, well, that's andesite, but what about just a stone? You know what? Let's try it. We've got, we got stone right in here. Um, if I took four stone and put them in a circle, that still doesn't get me anything. But can I build a chisel now, maybe? I want to make some nice blocks. I want to make some good-looking blocks. We still need an unfamiliar item. We don't know what iron is still. So, I mean, what we might end up doing, though, is... What? Oh, no. This is why we need a door. All right, you can stay there, I guess. You're not hurting anything for now. And next time, when we come back, I think you're going to find that I've been doing a bit of work. So, uh, until then, I'll see you later. Bye!